All right, Taurus, this is going to be a reading for the sign of Taurus. Hope everybody is happy, healthy, safe, and doing well. Into the smoke, I release all energy that does not serve us, all negativity that surrounds us, and all fears that limit us. So it is. So this is going to be a reading for whoever's on your mind, Taurus, or whoever's thinking about you when you uh, watch this video. Let's see what messages we've got for the sign of Taurus. Whoever's got Taurus on their mind, let's see what the messages are. We've got, I wish I could be fully honest with you. So someone here is wishing that they could be fully honest with you, Taurus. Okay. You are so different than everyone around me. This has been coming out for a few signs as well. Um, I think it came out with Gemini in one of my readings yesterday. So you guys might want to check those out. Be sure to check out your other placements, at least like your top three or the person, whoever you may have on your mind. Okay, check out their, their sign as well. All signs should be posted by today. So go into the video tab and scroll down. So let's see, what else are the messages, please? For Taurus, we got, don't put up with my BS. Someone is telling you, Taurus, don't put up with their BS or you, uh, you know, maybe telling someone this. Keep in mind, energy can be reversed. So flip it, switch it according to your situation. All right, so we've got drama. I've seen that on the bottom of the deck too. This card has never came out for any of the signs and you guys are second to last. So um, drama, there could be some drama here going on. Someone saying don't put up with their BS or maybe you just don't put up with their BS. Someone here isn't being fully honest with you. This person may also have other people around them. Um, how do I say this? Like the people that they have around them may be wearing like a false mask or people who like, so say if someone is around people who they're not completely honest with, or those people aren't completely honest with them, this person is, you know, they're surrounded by people of like character. Okay. You're different from everyone around them. And this person wishes that they could be fully honest with you, but they're not. And they're saying, don't put up with their BS. This person may have a lot of drama around them for whatever reason. I don't know. Okay. All right. What else is the messages, please? If I could go back in time, I would handle this differently. So someone here is wishing or thinking if they could go back in time, they would have handled this situation differently. Can't go back to the past, though, but we have the power to change the future. So I don't know. Shoulda, coulda, woulda. All right, what else for Taurus? Um, how could you ever forgive the mess I've made? So someone here is wondering, how could you ever forgive the mess that they've made? So this person may be just like lacking hope because they know that there was some type of drama or BS that happened between the two of you and they wish that they could have handled this different. Um, and they wish that they could probably tell you the truth about this, but for whatever reason, they may feel like they can't. Um, I can't stop thinking about you. So this person can't stop thinking about you, Taurus. Okay, but they can't be fully honest with you at the same time. All right. Or maybe that's what they're not telling you. All right. What else do we got for Taurus? Uh, will this ever change? This person may be wanting to know if something in the situation will ever change. Will this ever change? Or you may be wondering, will this ever change? Okay. I, I'm getting the strong sense in this reading that someone may have people around them that create unnecessary drama or BS or, um, yeah, I need to figure myself out. So someone here is saying I need to figure myself out. Okay. Will this ever change? Like this person may be, is this like expecting change yet doing nothing about it maybe? Okay. Like I said, we can't change the past, but we have the power to change the future. So, all right. So let's see. What else do we got? I can't handle your love. So someone here feels like they can't handle your love, Taurus. <laughs> it's just all too much. It's just all too much, Taurus. I can't handle it. I can't handle it, Taurus. Oh my gosh. Okay. What else? I wish I could understand you. So this person may wish that they could understand you better. All right. Um, you are too nice and I don't deserve your kindness. So this person feels like they don't deserve 
your kindness. That's came out for a few seconds as well. All right, so this is going to be from the Messages of Love Oracle deck. Let's see what messages we have for Taurus. Whoever's thinking about my Taurus or whoever Taurus is thinking about. What are the messages, please? If you guys are getting something from this reading or you enjoy this, please be sure to hit the like button. If you guys want to see more of these readings, um, let me know by smashing that thumbs up. All right, so let's see. Six cards. You got daydreaming. I am always longing for you. So this person may daydream about you while they're at work or while they're doing whatever they're doing. Okay, this person may be fantasizing or daydreaming about you, longing for you. Okay, what else? These cards are super slippery, so. All right, so we got reflection. Being away from you has allowed me to gain clarity. So this person feels like they... I don't know, I guess maybe they are reflecting on a situation, but it's it's came with the absence of you. Okay, what else? Time. I'm afraid it is too late to take action, escape. This These two cards just came out for other signs too. Um, I am afraid it's too late to take action. Again, this person feels like they don't know how to approach this situation. They feel like it may be too late. Um, escape. I left when things got hard so someone here may have left a situation when when something got too difficult for them okay too difficult for them to handle it's just all too much they couldn't handle your love they couldn't handle what it is that maybe you um were looking for or i don't know i don't want to say that because i don't want to people to flip it but Maybe of what you desire or you expect was just too much for this person to like in the energy that they were in. Soul tie, I always feel connected to you. So some of you guys may have a soul tie with this person or you feel a strong connection to this person and you got commitment. I want to, I want you to be a part of my future. So this is saying, you know, this person may want commitment later down the road. They may want you to be a part of their future. But this person is in the energy of trying to figure themselves out. They may be running from a situation or they may be questioning whether too much time has passed. Um, I do feel like they're reflecting and daydreaming on this situation. Um, yeah, bottom of the deck, you got gossip. I'm afraid of what other people will think. Yeah, that's that drama card. <laughs> Someone here and you are so different than the people around me. There may be people around them that are gossipy or that, or, you know, this person may be uh, superficial or someone who just cares what other people will think, what other people will say, or maybe there is some type of gossip surrounding this situation. How will you ever forgive the mess that I've made? Someone here may have even told lies on you or, um, said some things that weren't quite honest or they weren't honest with the people around them about this situation. And so, you know what I'm getting off this? Someone here may have even like, like, I'm just going to give an example. It might not be this exactly, but someone here could have said like, oh, uh, Taurus is a cheater or I don't like Taurus. I don't want to be with Taurus and blah, blah, blah. And then now it's like they can't stop thinking about you, daydreaming. They can't stop thinking about you. I wish I could be fully honest with you, but they feel like they can't be fully honest because they gossiped about you and created all this drama. And now there's unnecessary BS. How could you ever forgive the mess that I've made? Now it's like this person is sitting here longing for you, but they're also afraid of what other people will think or what people will say. It's like, why are you going back towards that person if they were this and that and you know, this, that, and the third. So this person may have ghosted you when things got too hard. It was too hard to keep up with these lies or with this facade or whatever it was, this mess that they created. But they feel this strong attachment to you and they're hoping that later on down the line that you two can be, you know, in each other's future. All right, so let's see. What else are the messages here for Taurus? This is the heart's hidden secrets, If in case any of you are wondering. You got, whoa, shit, twin flames, mirroring, shatter, or shared feelings. Um, shattered feelings. Anyway, shared feelings and reflection. So some of you, you guys could be mirroring one another. There could be a strong soul tie or twin flame energy here. Um, all right, we got a reflection again. 
abandoned, dismissed, and internal or irrational fear. I almost said internal fear. But yeah, someone here is reflecting. Someone here has, you know, maybe abandonment issues or someone dismissed this situation, abandoned it because of some type of irrational fear. Something that wasn't really real. Okay, you've got absurdity, secrets, mysteries, and concealing. So this person could be very secretive or they may be concealing something or hiding something. They may have a lot of secrets or there's some type of mystery behind this situation. It could be the block. You got karma, consequences, cause and effect, and debt. So someone here could also be going through karma for the way that they treated you. You have... Um, if I could go back in time, I would have handled this differently. So someone could be getting some type of karma perspective, better off happiness and clear headspace. So this could be something that you're doing or someone here is trying to clear their headspace, gain a new perspective on this situation, or someone has gained a new perspective on this situation. Um, maybe they're realizing that they would have been better off with you. They would have been happy with you after clearing their headspace. Okay. I feel like this person's still in the energy of trying to figure that out, though. You have elusive, uh, dishonesty, deception, uh, and trickery. And that's the same as this escape card. You got pain on the bottom of the deck, apprehensive, afraid, and cautious. So someone here is definitely like... I feel like someone here is like a runner. Like they're elusive. They use some type of form of escapism or they elude something. And that's where the dishonesty is coming from. They leave when things get too hard or they're they're elusive, they're they're deceptive, they're trickery, and they're starting to realize that maybe something that's going on in their life may be a, a consequence, you know, cause and effect of karma. And they're starting to gain a new perspective of over something, but they're not quite they're still concealing that. They're not they're they're reflecting on it, which is good. Um This person may also, you know, either have a lot of gossipy people around them with you or so different from the people around me and gossip. I'm afraid of what other people will say. I feel like this person may have done a lot of talking or there was a lot of chatter between whoever you, you know, you and this person. And this person's trying to figure this out. And it's becoming a lot for them to handle. They're wanting to know if something will ever change, but they can't stop thinking about you. Let's see what signs you could be dealing with. For Taurus, please, what signs? You got Sagittarius, Aquarius, Aquarius. So strong Aquarius, Saggy. What else? You got Taurus, Taurus, Virgo. <laughs> so Aquarius, Taurus, Virgo, Saggy. All right. Who else? You got Sagittarius again. You got a Pisces and Virgo again. So strong Virgo here as well. Uh, could be dealing with those signs or you may have those placements in your chart or this person does. Okay, I hope that this helped you guys. I hope it gave you some type of clarity. If it did, let me know by hitting that thumbs up. And I shall see you guys in the next video. Peace.